Hi friends, now I will tell you about a very useful topic and that is cake baking and icing tips. I did a lot of research, research on this topic to bake a nice pretty cake for my family. Today, for every occasion we need a cake. Even at tea time, we sometimes need a cake, a plain cake. Here in Goa, Goa. In the market, we get plain banana cake, carrot cake and chocolate cake which are in high demand. Before, I used to always like pineapple cake with pineapple pieces in it. To bake a proper cake, we need to remember some important things. First, it is going to be just a plain cake. If it's going to be a plain cake without icing, then directly make it. It will be faster also because the icing takes a lot of time just to eat at tea time. But first preheat the oven at 180 degrees Celsius and then bake the cake at 160 degrees Celsius for 25 to 30 minutes if it is going to be on the flatter side. To avoid burning you must always check with a toothpick. After 25 minutes of baking open the dough not before that then use a cake baking strip slightly moist or wet it and then squeeze it and put it around the cake tin to avoid hardening of the edges of edges of the cake and to avoid a dome on top you'll get like a soft flat cake second use exact measurements for the wet and dry ingredients as told in the recipe Third, once the cake is put to bake in the oven, don't open the dough, as I said before, for 25 minutes because it changes the temperature inside the oven while the cake is still getting baked and it will affect the baking. Fourth, after the baking is over, take out the cake tin but keep it as it is outside for 10 minutes. Don't overturn the cake before that. Then turn it over the cooling rack and cool it for half an hour to one hour. You can put it in a ziplock bag and keep it in the fridge if you will do the icing later. Icing comes out nice on a cool cake. Fifth, don't forget to put a butter paper on the cake tin before putting in the batter as sometimes just dusting flour on oil or butter makes the cake stick to the tin at some places. Sixth, use a pre-mix to get a good textured cake for icing. Now for the icing, there are many types. American icing which is very much lasting with butter and sugar. But it is too sweet. You can have it or discard it. Depends on you. What is your choice? Then whipped cream icing is there but it has a drawback that it can be kept outside the fridge only for one hour. After that it starts melting. Also to make it, the bowl should be cool. You have to keep it in ice cubed water or in another bowl with ice cubes. And all these things you have to keep in mind. Then there is another icing called Swiss meringue in which we use egg whites. But here we have to be cautious to pasteurize the eggs there is a process to pasteurize the eggs you can use a thermometer if you have a kitchen thermometer and put the eggs in water when the temperature becomes 60 degrees celsius the eggs get pasteurized that is the bacteria which is there dies and your cake will not get contaminated Chocolate ganache is also lasting for chocolate cakes. Seventh, don't use too much sugar water on the cake in between layers. Just brush it if you feel your cake is dry. Because too much sugar water makes the cake taste very sweet and very wet and it doesn't be 
very nice to taste for anyone it is very bad becomes very bad then eighth always dip your spatula in warm water to smoothen the icing and clean it every time on the rim of your icing bowl to get a smooth finish of the, on the cake when you are icing the cake and even you will get good smooth sharp edges if you use this technique you can make chocolate decorations much ahead and keep them in a tiffin or a container in the fridge you can even make flowers of buttercream or american icing much before the icing of the cake and freeze them and keep so at the icing time you'll be able to do the icing faster if all these things are ready you can also bake cool and put the cake in a ziploc bag and keep in the fridge for 2 days in advance to decorate later all this saves your time if you wait to do all these things on one day it will be very messy and you will be very tired and you may forget some things or some mistakes can happen so you can take a week to slowly slowly do things if you use a narrow cake tin the better layer will be thick and so the cooking time will increase by 10 five to 10 minutes more than what is mentioned in the recipe always check with a toothpick till it comes dry after 25 minutes of the baking time if you use a wide cake tin for the same batter the cake will be flatter and the cooking time will be even 5 minutes less than the, that mentioned in the recipe if you take interest you can bake and decorate a beautiful cake like professional bakers i did the last icing cake with american icing with two hearts a small one on top of a bigger one it became very nice or liked it the icing was too sweet and that's why i discarded it it is each one's choice children may like it and even people who have diabetes and all should never have it happy baking as it is a joy to bake a cake and decorate for your family friends if you like my channel do like share comment and subscribe take care and bye for now